High blood glucose levels are medically referred to as hyperglycemia. Those who suffer from diabetes often experience this issue. People with both type 1 and type 2 diabetes, as well as pregnant women with gestational diabetes, are vulnerable. Although it can occasionally affect non-diabetics, it typically only affects the very sick, such as those who have recently suffered a heart attack, stroke, or severe infection. Here are 10 signs that your blood sugar is high and can also be diabetes symptoms. 1. You're hungrier than usual but losing weight. According to Medline Plus, a condition known as polyphagia manifests itself in many individuals whose high blood sugar cannot be brought under control when they experience an increase in hunger beyond what is typical for them. According to the Mayo Clinic, even though you are increasing the amount of food you consume, you may still be losing weight for no discernible reason if your blood sugar levels are too high. Doctors explain that because your body is not getting energy from the preferred source, glucose, it must turn to muscle and fat in order to get its energy needs met. When your body begins breaking down muscle and fat for energy, you experience weight loss that is both unintentional and unhealthy. Emmanuel adds that in addition to these shifts in weight and appetite, you may also notice a weakness in your muscles and experience more frequent falls. 2. You feel tiredness and fatigue constantly. Symptoms of blood sugar that is not under control include fatigue and extreme tiredness. When your body is not processing insulin properly or it doesn't have sufficient amounts of insulin, the sugar stays in our blood rather than getting into our cells to be used for energy. Additionally, having to urinate frequently can result in dehydration, which doctors identifies as another factor that contributes to fatigue. 3. You have noticeably blurry vision and frequent headaches. It's possible that you'll become aware that your vision isn't as sharp as it once was, and that certain things will appear hazy to you. According to the Joslin Diabetes Center in Boston, having high blood sugar levels can cause fluid to leak into your eyes, causing your lenses to become swollen and blurry. This results in the lens losing its original shape, which prevents it from focusing properly and causes vision to become blurry. According to Emmanuel, you may also find that you are having difficulty at work, that you have difficulty driving, and that you frequently suffer from headaches. 4. Swollen or bleeding gums, which increase your infection risk. According to the National Institute of Diabetes and Digestive and Kidney Diseases, Gum disease is a complication that can arise from having diabetes. According to the American Diabetes Association ADA, an infection causes the body to release more glucose into the bloodstream than normal. This can make it more difficult to keep diabetes under control. Your saliva contains glucose, and the more glucose it contains, the more glucose there is to feed the bacteria that combine with food in your mouth to form plague and cause gum disease. If your saliva contains a high concentration of glucose, then the risk of gum disease increases. At first, patients may notice that their gums are red or swollen. According to the Mayo Clinic, if they are not treated, they can progress to periodontitis, which can cause the gums to pull away from the teeth, the appearance of pus or ulcers, and even the loss of teeth. If this occurs, it's important to treat gum disease as soon as possible. Get your blood sugar under control and see a dentist regularly to avoid your gums and teeth becoming damaged as a result of uncontrolled diabetes. 5. You're getting yeast infections more often than usual. If you have hyperglycemia, you may experience yeast infections of the genital tract more frequently. According to the American Diabetes Association ADA, the causative agent is frequently a species of yeast known as Candida albicans. In females, the symptoms can include, as described by the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, vaginal itching, redness or soreness, pain during sexual intercourse, pain or discomfort during urination, and thick, abnormal vaginal discharge. Even though yeast infections are common in people who do not have diabetes, if you have a higher concentration of glucose in your blood, you have a greater likelihood of developing one. The yeast feeds off the glucose, which explains why there is more glucose in the urinary tract when a person has high blood. 
Men who have hyperglycemia but have not had circumcisions are also at risk. The endocrinologist continues by saying, We're also seeing this happen a little more now with patients who take SGLT2 inhibitors, which are medications that coerce the body into eliminating more glucose through the urine. In the prescribing information for SGLT2 inhibitors, the Food and Drug Administration has included a warning about a far more uncommon genital condition that has the potential to be fatal. This condition is known as necrotizing fasciitis of the perineum or Fournier's gangrene, commonly known as flesh-eating disease. 6. You're developing blisters, dryness, or other skin changes. According to the American Diabetes Association, ADA, people who have diabetes and are actively seeking methods to better manage their weight are more likely to develop small pieces of extra skin known as skin tags in the folds and creases of their skin. Acanthosis nigricans is the medical term for the dark, thick, and soft areas of skin that can develop anywhere on the body, including the back of the neck, hands, armpits, face, and other places. According to doctors, these can be indicators of insulin resistance. High blood sugar can manifest itself in a variety of skin conditions, including blisters, infections, dryness, itchiness, discolorations, and abnormalities of the skin. If any of these skin changes occur, you should consult with your physician. 7. You notice tingling and numbness in your hands or feet. An uncontrolled blood sugar level can lead to diabetic neuropathy which is another name for nerve damage. In your hands and feet, you might experience tingling or even numbness. This is something that you might notice. In addition, some people have reported experiencing pain in their hands and feet. Those who have had diabetes for a longer period of time are more likely to experience neuropathy, but anyone with poorly controlled diabetes is at risk for developing the condition. 8. You develop sores that tend to heal more slowly than usual. According to the National Institute of Diabetes and Digestive and Kidney Diseases, uncontrolled blood sugar can cause a delay in the healing process for a variety of wounds, including cuts, scrapes, bruises, and other types of wounds. Diabetes causes nerve damage and affects circulation, particularly in the lower legs and feet. This can slow healing because there isn't enough blood flow to the area, which is caused by the lack of oxygen-rich blood. Even relatively minor wounds have a greater risk of developing infections, which can quickly become very serious and even lead to the amputation of the affected limb, such as the food. According to the American Pediatric Medical Association, if you develop a food ulcer, you may notice drainage seeping onto your socks or a foul odor. Both of these symptoms may be present. 9. Frequent Urination Four to seven times a day is the typical number of times a person needs to urinate. If you're going to the bathroom more frequently, especially if you're getting up several times during the night to use the restroom, your kidneys may be working overtime to flush out excess sugar in your blood. This is especially likely if you're going to the bathroom more frequently at night. Keep in mind that drinking too much water, especially late at night, may be the reason you urinate a lot. If you are urinating more than once or twice during the night, try to avoid drinking after 7 p.m. and consuming caffeinated beverages after 5 p.m. There may be something else going on if you still need to get up several times during the night to use the bathroom. 10. Volatile Moods Having blood sugar that is unstable can be like riding a roller coaster, which can cause irritability. A high blood sugar level can also cause symptoms that are similar to those of depression. These symptoms include low energy drive and a desire to stay in bed. If you have family or friends who comment on your strange demeanor, have depression mimicking symptoms, or if you are noticeably grumpy or irritable, these are warning signs. What do you think of our video? Let me know in the comment section below. If you enjoyed this video and want to hear from me again, be sure to hit that subscribe button before you go. Thanks for watching!